did it! Midnight's awake. Here we go! Whee! Okie dokie, Midnight. What story did you find for us to read today? Ranger Forester. Written by Belle Richardson and illustrated by Makita Harris. If you love to read, then follow my lead. It's S T O R Y T I M E. Story time with S A N D I. Story time, Sandy. Midnight, are you hiding up here? Hmm. Oh, hi there, little readers. I'm playing a game of hide and go seek with Midnight, but I can't find him anywhere. And I think he may have fallen asleep in his hiding spot because you and I both know he loves sleeping. In fact, I hear him snoring. Do you hear him snoring? You do? <laughs> okay, it's not just me. Hmm. Oh, I know. Maybe if we sing the magic words together, he'll wake up, come out of hiding, and then we can all read a story together. Does that sound fun? Yes! All right, ready? One, two, three. Sleepy midnight, please wake up fast. We'd like to read a story from the past. I said, sleepy midnight, please wake up fast. We'd like to read a story from the past. Say it with me, sleepy midnight, please wake up fast. We'd like to read a story from the past! <laughs> Little readers, you did it! Midnight's awake. Here we go! Whee! Okie dokie, Midnight. What story did you find for us to read today? Ranger Forester. Written by Belle Richardson and illustrated by Makita Harris. Ranger Forester looks after a forest. He knows all animals in this forest. If an animal is missing or hurt, Ranger Forester knows. Forester keeps animal families safe. Ranger Forester is walking. Forester can see bugs. Bugs are good for forests. It means that a forest is balanced. Ranger Forester sees bees. These bees will not sting. Little readers, how many bees do you see? Hey, I got an idea. Why don't we count them together? Are you ready? One, two, three. Ranger Forester is walking. Forester can hear bird song. Forester knows which bird it is by its song. Forester finds a feather. Forester knows a bird by its feathers. Hey, how many birds do you see? One, two, three. And see, Ranger Forester found a white feather. Which bird do you think that feather belongs to? There's a red bird, a blue bird, and a red, black, and white bird. This one? I agree. The feather probably belongs to this bird with a white belly. Great job! Let's get back to the story. Ranger Forester sees a snake. Oh my. Forester is not scared. Forester will watch the snake as it sits on a rock in the sun. This snake is sleepy. It will not bite. Still, Forester knows to stay away. Ranger Forester can see spiders in webs. These spiders are eating. Spiders get insects in webs. Spiders spin silk sacks. Insects turn to drink. Forester watches spiders fix webs that bugs broke. How many spiders are there? One, two, two spiders. Ranger Forester sees a kangaroo family. A little kangaroo is missing. Where is the little kangaroo? Ranger Forester will look for it. Forester looks in scrub. Forester sees tracks. Oh 
a look. Do you see? There's the tracks. I wonder where they're heading. Let's turn the page and find out. The little kangaroo is stuck. Its tail is in a trap. Yikes! Forrester is upset. He frees the kangaroo. Forrester checks its tail. It is not bad. This little kangaroo will heal. It bounces away. It finds its family. Forrester keeps the trap. He will find who laid it. Forrester brings the trap along to a meeting. The rangers are all upset. Who would set a trap in the forest? The rangers find who laid the traps and they get cops. The animals are safe again. Hip hip hooray! Those animals are sure lucky to have Ranger Forrester looking after them. The story's all done. I hope you had fun with S-T-O-R-Y-T-I-M-E Story time with S-A-N-D-I Story time, Sandy. Midnight and I sure do love reading with all of you. <gasps> you know what else we would love to read? A special secret message written just by you. So grab a grown-up and ask them to help you write a message for us down below. And hey, before you go, let's read another story together. All you have to do is click that box right there. Let's go! Well, aren't you coming? Come on! Click the box and I'll see you in the next story.